Hi everybody and welcome back to Callback, the show that takes you behind the scenes of the amazing art of community theater right in your own community. I'm your host, Jeff Shore, and welcome back to City of Angels right here on Callback. In the last episode, I introduced you to the amazing cast of this musical that I'm directing at Brexville Theater on the Square. We open March 13th and we're hot and heavy in rehearsals now and things are really starting to get exciting as the production elements really start to heat up and come together. And you're a part of all the action right here on Callback. Obviously one of the most important elements in any musical is, well, the music. This new routine is too routine. It needs work. City of Angels, particularly the Angel City Four, the quartet that sort of acts as the Greek chorus of the show. They pop up throughout the entire production and comment on the action as it happens, but the music they have to perform is some of the most wonderful jazz vocal arrangements that you're going to hear in any contemporary musical. We just happen to have four great musicians as part of our Angel City Four, and I'd like to introduce you to them now. Meet the Angel City Four as part of City of Angels. Hollywood and Vine, entertainment capital of the world, it's the Hour of Power! The music is spectacular. Can I help you, or are you just window shopping? Um, very sort of old school vibe, Cole Porter kind of um, feeling, and it's very jazzy, and, and that's the kind of stuff I like. Very challenging to sing. And do. Like a diamond in a coal mine, she's where you will least expect. I love this score. It's not a very well known show, but um, it's got an excellent score by Cy Coleman and Dave Zippel. Uh, very jazzy, very energetic, and it's very challenging music, especially the quartet that we're in, but it's, it's a lot of fun. Try to drag her down. Phenomenal. I love, 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 love the quartet music. It's a lot of fun, very challenging, um, but we have an excellent crew in the quartet. They've been a lot of fun to work with, and um, I hope everyone enjoys what we bring to the show. Take a little look, see those around, there's other and proud scouts. Use a little intuition if you must show the ship to them. No, I've never seen her. I've seen girls like this so young and ripe. Missing miss is not the type to miss a misdemeanor. Two of the girls from the Angel City Quartet decided that I should just be a floating head. Or just this one. Let's not think twice. Let's not think twice. Be stolen. We're a month out now, which um, means we're really getting down to business and uh, starting to really interact with each other, and, that, and that's been really great. In your heart. I'm really good friends with Shonda, who plays one of the Angel City Four, and when we saw this, we flipped our wigs. Uh, we were so excited to um, possibly be a part of this. So we both auditioned together, we're both in the show together, and we both get to work together, which is absolutely fantastic. This cast has just been working so hard. You're just gonna love them as much as I do because they're just such professionals. Suck. 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 Wait, what? What is it? Professionals. 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 
These are the sexies. Well, we have to smoke during the show. And I, I don't nothing. know about sexy. <laughs> but I'm smart. You're just gonna love them as much as I do. It's suck, suck inhale, inhale, and slowly blow. Is that okay? Hi, my name is Jeremy Short. I play Big Six, and I am really excited. It's a great part. It's a great show. Um, this is a great group of people, very talented singers, very talented performers, and I'm just excited to be around them. Just another hoary chestnut from the bottom drawer I've heard so often before that I can't laugh anymore. Also doing some voiceover work uh, with one of the principal actors. All right, sound cue three in three, two, one. The appreciation was all mine. Just one look and you knew Alora Villiers was a handful. Maybe two if you played your cards right. She had the kind of face a man could hang a dream on. A body that made Venus de Milo look all thumbs. And only the floor kept her legs from going on forever. And see I close my eyes and see and a